And Chappers, this is a mentality problem at the football club. And it hasn't happened overnight. It's been there for many years. Arsenal have lost that steeliness, that determination. They don't work together as a unit. The distances between the units are not right. You've got to work on it on the training pitch. So that's a great bit of analysis. I reckon I've seen similar types of Arsenal analysis three, four times a season, every season of doing this show. Martin said, we practised under George Graham till the cows came home. Do you think this is personnel? Do you think this is coaching? Nature, nurture? Um, I think I think it's a mixture of the both. I do think there's been um, almost like a cultural change, you know, from within Arsenal from from Martin's era to where we are now. I think there was, if you look at, you know, the, the, the players that had so much steel within kind of uh, themselves, whether it's Martin or you know Vieira or it's Tony Adams or Sol Campbell. These these players. They, yes, they could play football, but they had something else about them. And somewhere along the line, over the years, they've lost all of that. And we've got a bunch of players now that are more obsessed with just playing football rather than actually doing the ugly stuff in a game. And I think you know that's why, why Martin the, has highlighted that. There the today. creative days, when Wenger first came back in the good old days, we'd formulated our personalities as defenders. And then the creative players came and were bolted onto that. But we, there was a, a team responsibility. And we understood and we got those... But they could be drilled to be better. They can definitely be drilled to do that. It's a responsibility. You first of all got to want to do it. If I'm playing against Puki today, there's no way he grabs the headlines tomorrow. Absolutely no way. I'm all over him. And that mentality has to change. And it has to be done on the training pitch, Mavid. Freddie has to be able to do this. Mm. Has he got the capability to, to coach it? I'm sure he understands it. He was a very diligent, hard-working player himself in a successful team. He's now got to become that as a coach. Thanks for checking out the BBC Sport YouTube channel. Remember to give this video a like and make sure you subscribe and hit the bell button so you never miss an upload. See you soon.